junior section director at Big Cove Camp this summer. And I'm Julia, and I'm the senior section director. And we're here with this, this instructional video to teach you how to hash. And basically what that is is two campers from each cabin are responsible for setting the tables. Because that's what we call table setters. So hashing happens three times a day. When the hasher bell rings, <laughs> you will first wash your hands very well with soap and water, and then come into the pavilion and go up and look at that sign up there. For this meal breakfast, you will need a big plate, a big bowl, a cup, and cutlery. Someone will be standing here with this lovely dish cob hat, directing you if you need a send assistance. Just like that. So, Julian and I are going to demonstrate how to hash a table. We're going to hash Pegasus. And then, what you're going to do is, you with your co-hasher, are going to go grab plates, bowls, cups, cutlery you need from the buckets and shelves that are in the red cabinets in the front of the pavilion. And you're going to set one for every person at your table. But that's not all. So, when you're grabbing your cups, it's really important that you take them from the clean cups basket, which is not going to Otherwise, you'll be taking them from the dirty cups basket, and that's where the cups go that everyone has already used, so you can, you can set the table with these. So after you set your table, you're going to go up to the window here, where our lovely kitchen help is. Say hi, Sarah. Cold food will be kept at the kitchen window, which you will take one of each to your table. So that includes one jug of water, maybe some salad dressing, salad, etc. After you're done that, you're going to go back outside, and then we're going to ring the bell for lunch, dinner, and breakfast. And you're going to come back into the pavilion. You're going to sit down, we're going to sing a mealtime appreciation song, which is a lot of fun. And then one hasher from each group is going to walk up to the window. And it's really important that you don't stand in front of the green line that's painted on the floor. It's really important that you don't step in front of the line because someone could be coming with a hot meal and spill it all oh. over you. And that wouldn't be good. So, you're going to respect the line. Anything else you need, you can take it and bring it back to your table. Then you're going to enjoy your fantastic meal because we have great cooks here at Big Coke. Once the meal's over, Everyone in your cabin will pass their plates around so that they form a nice stack and scrape all the food waste onto one plate, even though there shouldn't be any, and pour all the liquids into one cup or one bowl. Then you're going to dump any extra food and liquids, and then you're going to put the rest of the dirty dishes that are, have now been scraped to the best of your ability in the dirty dish window. And then, after everything is taken from your table, so you can put all the extra food back in through the silver window, you're going to grab a cloth from the cloth bucket next to the cutlery buckets here, and then you're going to wipe down your table, and then you're going to have a super duper awesome day. And that's it from Hatching. Remember to take what you need, eat what you take. This was Brianna Lane. And this was Julie Nerskin. Teaching you how to hash. Section directors out.